Okay, so for breakfast, we're having overnight oats again. This has like 15 grams of birthday cake protein in it, almond milk, a little bit of sugar-free syrup, and then we have 35 grams of this lemon cheesecake cashew butter. It is so good. And then we have about 15 raspberries in there. So our breakfast is the overnight oats and the raspberries. This is so good and fills me up. I just love this as my breakfast. This and yogurt bowls are probably my two favorite. Okay, it's snack time. So I'm gonna make a little snack with y'all. So we're gonna have some hard salami, a light string cheese, a light string cheese. These are 45 calories. And then you can have six slices for 110 calories. We'll probably have like 80 calories worth of this. And then I'm gonna have just a little bit of this as well. A little proteiny carb snack. And then I'm gonna go ahead and show you all this. I'm just having, it's a 90 calorie Rice Krispie Treat. I wanna find the mini Rice Krispie Treat so it's a little less calorie, but I'm somebody that has to have a little bit of a carby, sugary like boost before I work out. I just have to, or I feel sick. I don't know why, but I do. So this is 90 calories. I'm gonna eat this right before I work out. But for now, my snack will be this. And so I'm gonna measure it up and then I'll show y'all. And then I'm not doing very good with my water today. Normally I don't have an issue with it, but for some reason I haven't drank, I haven't even finished 40 ounces yet. Well, I probably drank 40 ounces yet um, because I had a little bit left in my Stanley. I just normally don't count what's left from the night before. Um, but anyway, I haven't finished my first full one. So I'm going to fill up this 32 ounce one with the rest of this Neo, which is not much. This is the orange vanilla Mio. It's one of my favorites. It's so good. But I had, didn't have as much left as I thought I did. And I don't have any other orange vanilla ones. So I have this white grape peach, which is not my favorite. But I'm going to add that as well. Alright, so we got our water. So we can get some more water down. Our cheese stick. Let's measure some of this out. Okay, so this is 14 grams, which is half a serving, which I know is not much, but just have a little bit. Turkey pepperoni is definitely better on calories and protein. And I think I'm just gonna do 14 grams of this too, another half serving. Here's our little morning snack. And then we got our water and our pre-workout. All right, I'll see y'all. I'm gonna try to show you my workout today, but I keep forgetting, so we'll see if I show you or not. But if not, the next thing you'll see is probably lunch, or I do have some hauls to show y'all today. Okay, we're taking a break, and we have some hauls to show you. We got a lot of stuff. We have a team new haul, and then we have a paper pie haul. Um, and then we also have a clean, simple eats haul. I forgot about that one. We have that to show you as well. Let me go grab the clean, simple eats haul, get these opened, and then we'll see what I ordered. Okay, so we'll start with the um, clean, simple eats haul. I they had free shipping. I don't remember why. Was their anniversary or something? And so I bought just a whole bunch of samples. A whole bunch of samples. I already have used two, I think, because I had a smoothie with the cake batter one, and then I have a Ninja Creamy one in the freezer that was the cake batter as well. So I had two cake batters, which I've already used, but then we also got two of the Snickerdoodle um, mint chocolate cookie, which I know I love this one. This one's really good. We got the strawberry cheesecake, and then we got a Simply Vanilla. I wish I would have got more of the Simply Vanilla because I know I like this one too. Um, this is what I had been using for my Ninja Creamies. Um, so I just bought several of these since they had free shipping. Um, the reason I didn't buy like a big tub is because I have that big tub of 1UP Nutrition Cake Batter. The reason I bought more is because I think I like these better. At first I wasn't sold on them. Um, because they're not super sweet. They're definitely like on the simpler side. Like they said, like, um, they're not as strong sweet flavors. 
but they don't have an aftertaste to me at all. They don't have a bad aftertaste. They're just, I feel like I like these. And they do, these do really, really, really good in the Ninja Creamy with for the ice creams. Um, so I just got a few to use for my ice creams. The Snickerdoodle one I want to try with Nicole Burgess's like protein waffles. Um, because she uses like a cinnamon one and she likes that for her. So I keep dropping these. So I wanted to try these um, for those waffles as well. And I just need to use up the birthday cake one before I buy another big tub. But these are only 100 calories and 20 grams of protein. My One Up Nutrition one's like 130-ish calories, I think. So I've been really enjoying those. So I wanted to talk about that. If you haven't tried Clean Temple Eats, I would definitely try them. Now for the teeny haul. This one is a pretty big haul. This is not sponsored at all. I bought all this with my own money. Um, actually, I think I'm going to do the paper pie one next because this is a smaller haul. One of my friends um, did a paper pie. Like, she hosted one of those parties. Um, and my kids love, love, love these books. Like, they really do. So, I just bought two more. Um, I, the shipping, these are just kind of pricey. If they weren't so expensive, I probably would have bought more because my kids really do love them. A Lifestyle of Literacy and Learning, books you're bound to love, you are what you're reading. That's cute. So this is the box. And we got lots of packing paper. But these are the two picks we picked out. We got, so it came with, we are Paper Pie, our story is our brand, and our brand is our story. Just a little advertisement. And then they sent like a booklet, like I guess their new catalog of books to look at. So that's neat. I'll probably will look through some of these just for more recommendations. I might end up buying my son a few more for his birthday because um, he really does love these. But we got What Are You Feeling? What Are Feelings? He likes these pop-up books. So, is it wrong to cry? And it has a flip up. And it says, no, you often feel better after a good cry. It also let others see you're hurt or upset so they can help. So, I think this is really cute. He'll love this with all the animals. This is for my three-year-old. Um, so, that's just some of those really pretty What Are Your Feeling books. Um, so, this book was... $14.99 so a little pricey but they definitely make really well um, and the illustrations are very pretty and then this one secrets of the apple tree it's a, a shine a light book we have the human body shine a light book and my son loves that one um, so I wanted to get another one so you just kind of shine the light through this page and it like um, will make this picture more bold I guess you could say um, but this is also a very pretty book and I know he'll like the shine a light part and he also is very curious and we have an apple tree growing in our backyard that he's really into so I think he'll love this as well so this is the other book I bought this one was $12.99 so my total with shipping was like $37 so not cheap but I like supporting friends and I love these books so that is for my three-year-old he'll be happy to see those and then our team new haul, we got some more of the pumps for my coffee syrups. I needed more of those. This paper feels weird. I don't know what's on it, it's kind of gross, but we're gonna wash those. We bought some more straws. I don't know how many's in here, 10, maybe 12. Just because I go through these a lot with my water cups and stuff. And my sons also like to chew on them when they drink out of my cups. Stuff like that. So, I got those. I finally bought one of those little dryer vents. What is it? It doesn't say what it is. But, um, I've seen these talked about. Um, like your dryer vent to get all the extra lint out. So, I wanted to try one of those. Um, oh, I finally bought a boot for my for my Stanley just a white color one I don't have my Stanley in here oh I do Let's see. 
Oh, that's cute. I like it. So the only thing is, it's gonna be a pain to take it off and on when I have to wash it, but it's cute. And I definitely like sitting it down better with the boot, that does help. Um, my husband asked for these for drilling for his Blackstone, just to be able to put oil and butter and stuff and just water for cleaning it better. So we got that. Now I got a lot of little things to wash that I can't put in the dishwasher. Perfect. This is probably what's all over it, actually, all over my stuff, actually, is this is a grill stone for cleaning his Blackstone. And I bet that is what is all over this stuff. So I will give him that and make him take it outside. The next thing we got is a wall mount. I have a TV. It's in my office that I use for my guide, my Peloton guide. Um, so I wanted to see if this would work. These are like 20-ish dollars, even more on Amazon. And this was less than 10. Comes with all the screws and the hard drives. So hopefully that works out. So we got a TV mount. We got um, a mini muffin, like a silicone mini muffin thing. So I'm excited to have that because I'm tired of everything sticking in those metal ones and being hard to open. This I got because this is the reason I placed this order. It's because um, my mom uses that charcoal soap and it gets all over her tub and stains it. And I'm like, you think you want to do to like drain it off the side? So I'm going to give this to her to try to see if it keeps it from like staining her shower. And then the last thing is a silicone muffin one. I'm excited to try these. The only thing I'm nervous about is this is pretty thin silicone. Like it's not, I don't feel like it's very thick. So that makes me a little nervous, but um, I will try it out. Hopefully it'll go okay because I've heard these are a lot easier to clean. So I hope it is. Okay, so that's my haul. I will say I'm pretty impressed, excited with what I got. Um, I'll let y'all know about these because these are the only things I'm really hesitant about. And the only thing that I'm not happy that, it, not not happy about, but I'm like, is there's a powdery stuff all over it. But I'm pretty sure it is that grill block. The grill block wasn't wrapped properly. Um, and I think it like was like breaking off on the stuff. But other than that, that was my Timu haul. And I'm gonna show y'all snack now. Okay, so for lunch, I know it kind of looks like a weird lunch, but we have the bear chicken tenders. That was the last of my bag, so I'm really hoping I can get some more at Sam's because I'm really loving those. We have some 2% good culture cottage cheese. I'm shaking, I guess, from my workout. And with some cheese on top. I know weird cheese to use too, but it was a block cheese I bought for a recipe, and that's just what was left. And then some barbecue sauce. We'll probably have some grapes and a vegetable for our snack later. But right now, this is our lunch. Okay, so for snack, we're having 180 grams I don't know if y'all can hear that, but it's thundering. It's definitely been really raining today. And we have 180 grams of green grapes. This is quite a bit. I don't know if I'll eat them all. Um, they need to be used up and ate. So I'm going to eat them. Instead of having cucumber, I'll just have quite a bit of this. I do think I like this boot. I filled it up with water again. And, like, it's so much easier to sit down. I feel like it grips, like, where you're sitting it a lot easier than just, like, without the boot so i'm excited about it the only thing is i don't know if it'll fit in my cup holder anymore but i do recommend getting a boot for your stanley for dinner we had some breakfast for dinner we had some bacon we had a great value frozen biscuit with a little bit of butter and jelly i used this reduced sugar jelly um 20 calories per tablespoon and it's really good we had an egg with some egg whites and then for dessert we had a ninja creamy ice cream it's a Fairlife milk and a Clean Simple Eats protein. And then I added um, mini M&Ms to the protein. And I share this every night with my little boy. Well, not every night, but I enjoy having this. And that's what I had this night. Thank you so much for watching.